fire is the element of life, energy, and desires. Without air, a fire could never exist. Aries is the ram, and a ram is like a sheep, only specifically male. I would say even beyond that, the fact that this ram has to be male, the ram representing Aries has to have big horns, and it has to be the alpha. If Aries is not the ram with the biggest horns, then they're just another sheep. There can be only one alpha, only one ram with the biggest horns, so Aries has this attitude of only me. It's competitive. It's not a partnership sign like Libra is. Sheep in general act really dumb. Research has shown that they're not as dumb as they act, but if you give them a mirror, it will reduce their stress levels. Aries is the most impatient sign, and being impatient also gives them the most initiative. They're the most likely to actually get things done. They charge into things head first without thinking. Leo is represented by the lion, and lions are the assholes of the jungle. I'm just kidding, they live in Africa, they don't live in the jungle. Male lions are so strong and so powerful, but they'll just kind of lay there and wait to be fed if they don't have to do anything. Female lions are big on teamwork and they'll work together uh, to bring down their kills. Unless um, they found someone else who already killed something, they'll just take it from them. Lions hate hyenas because hyenas are fucking annoying. Leo sometimes just feels like it has to prove its worth, and that's not a good situation for them to be in. Leo only wants to do things that they can be proud of, and this usually makes them very noble and loyal, but sometimes their sense of pride is a little bit warped and can make them selfish. For Leo, the curtain never really closes, and they don't do things that they don't expect people to find out about. They want to express themselves outwardly, though. They want people to see them. Nothing makes a Leo sadder than feeling ashamed. They want to be able to show off their pride, and they can be very harsh on people that they think lowly of. If someone does something that a Leo thinks is morally disgusting, like maybe if the person does something hyena-ish, then the Leo can get very mad. Granted, they can respect anyone as long as that person doesn't do something to make them lose respect. Sagittarius is another weird animal. It's the torso of a human on the body of a horse. And this allows them to have the intellect to be able to learn things and the legs and the mobility, the speed, whatever, to be able to travel and explore to different lands. I think of the bow and arrow that they're holding as a symbol of their luck. You know, you, you aim and you pull back and you hope it lands where it's supposed to, and Sagittarius is a lucky sign. Sagittarius is want the best, most broad, most expansive experiences possible. That and their love of adventure, I think, makes them kind of kiki, and it's fitting because they have this like weird centaur thing representing them. Sagittarius is the most yearning sign. They just want a lot of things in general. They care more about how people see them than Aries and Leo do. Leo just kind of wants people to see them and isn't really concerned with people's opinions. Sagittarius, however, actually cares how people see them. Sagittarius thinks a lot more than Aries does, and because Aries doesn't really stop to think. They don't have time to worry about, you know, what people will think about the way they're dressed or whatever. Sagittarius wants to be the best, but they're naturally lucky. So this luck can kind of make them take things for granted and lack the motivation. Sagittarius is often tend to feel like things just can or will fall into their lap, and that's because a lot of times they do. Um, Sagittarius and Leo can both be lazy, whereas Aries is the workaholic. But the thing is, Leos are motivated by pride. Sagittarius is motivated by feeling unsatisfied and feeling like they're not good enough. But sometimes they can end up feeling satisfied too easily without having to work very hard. So Sagittarius really need something that will leave them wanting more, and their yearning is inevitable. All the fire signs are pretty much competing with each other. There's Aries who wants to be 
the only one, the front and center. And then there's Leo who wants all the attention, all the recognition. And then there's Sagittarius who wants to be the best. They ha want to have the most things out of life. Aries works the hardest. Leo can work very hard, but will kind of just, you know, hope that someone else will just give them what they want. And Sagittarius really relies on luck the most. Personally, I think if all the other elements went extinct and it was only the fire signs left, we would all probably kill each other. So uh, comment below and let me know which fire sign you think would win.